So hi and welcome to another slasher review and as I mentioned yesterday I will be reviewing Sleepaway Camp 2 Unhappy Campers today. So let's get into the technical stuff as usual. It's from 1988 from the US directed by Michael A. Simpson and written by Fritz Gordon and based on the original story by Robert Hiltzik starring Pamela Springsteen, Renee Estevez, Valerie Hartman and Tony Higgins among other people. Okay, so if you haven't seen the first one, then this will be a mega spoiler to just say what it's about. So if you don't want to be spoiled, stop watching this review now. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, so the plot. So in the first one, uh, we get to know that the killer in the first one was Angela. Uh, and that she actually was a boy uh, so that was the big reveal that she had to f uh, she was being forced to live like a girl for yeah all of her teenage years and from when she was very young so and now Angela is all grown up and rehabilitated they think so she uh, gets a job as a camp counselor uh, at another camp and you know teenagers are being teenagers and the kids are being kids so whenever she feels that someone is doing something immoral her killing ways starts coming out again so in this film uh, we we already know who's doing the killing it's angela uh, and i think pamela springsteen did a good job portraying angela uh, as being a bit older and just crazy I mean, because she, she, she kills people left and right without, uh, without really caring. Because, uh, you know, if she sees someone in a smoking pod or having premarital sex or, or making a comment or anything, she would just kill them right away, like ice cold. And I think the kills in this film are fun. I mean, one uh, unhappy camper gets uh, drowned uh, in an outhouse yeah among shit and piss and leeches uh, and it's quite drawn out so it's a gruesome way to die uh, and they also do an homage to like Freddy and Jason in a scene where two kids are supposed to scare Angela and they have like a Freddy glove and some makeup for the burns and a really bad Jason mask but I do appreciate the homage very fun and as usual uh, the camp setting works really well in this one as well and I think Renee Estevez uh, is really her character is uh, really good and well written and you know I was really rooting for her really like seeing her uh, in films such as Intruder also and Heather Heathers so I think uh, Sleep Away Camp 2 is a really good sequel. I had a lot of fun rewatching it, and I'll probably rewatch it a lot of times. And as I mentioned yesterday, this is the box. Now we're pulling out number two. Yes, and this is it. Yes. So. My rating for this film uh, will be an 8 out of 10 actually also. Yeah, I think it totally deserves that. And it has a very high uh, kill count. Uh, she just kills people like all the time it seems. Uh, so it never gets boring. Uh, so if you haven't seen the sequels, uh, then I really do think you should. Uh, so yeah, thank you for watching. And you know, tomorrow I will of course review Sleepaway Camp. So bye, have an amazing evening.